Hey, what's up guys? It is Justin here back bringing you the trade day results. Uh, there are three players, like I said, from before, and it's around 6.45 p.m. I want to check the trades right now. I uh, don't want to hold them off for too long because people have been asking me on Twitter, like, when am I going to check the trades? Uh, they want to play games, so for sure, I do apologize about holding your guys' players, but hopefully uh, I do accept one of your trades, alright? But before we start, let's get into a maybe, let's do a special pack or a gold premium. See if we can get lucky before we start. Uh, I have exactly around just enough for one pack, so we'll open this up first, and then we'll go into the trade day results. And Fadun, Nemeth, Fontaine, nope, not good at all. The jersey, nope. All right, quick sell all, and then let's go right into the trade offer. So we still have uh, Jamie Ben, we got Giroux, and we got uh, Matt Duchesne. So I know we have a ton of offers. I just checked at least. I checked how many offers we got, so we're going to have to definitely see what we will choose. Uh, but three active, 65 trade offers, so that is 20 per each one. So thank you guys for sending in trades. So let's get right into the cheapest player right now, so Jamie Ben. What I might do is actually just keep the cycle going. Uh, once I get players or once I accept trades, I'll put them back up and then you guys can send in more trades. But first one here, uh, Jamie Ben. For Shattenkirk, McKinnon, and Carter. Boosted McKinnon and Carter. Does interest me. Uh, McKinnon's around 10k, I think. Uh, Carter is around 30. So you're getting about 40k. With the Pucks, you're getting about 47. With Shattenkirk, that's about 60k. That's pretty good. Uh, Alex Petrangelo. Uh, I think he's 65k. I think I think Petrangelo straight up is better than this deal, in my opinion. Uh, just because I can take a one-for-one -one deal. And Petrangelo is a great uh, defenseman. Uh, this deal, no thank you for that. I'm going to reject that. Uh, what else do we have here? David Krejci and Sharp. So Sharp is around uh, 25 to 30. Uh, so you're getting about 67k with David Krejci. So that is a very good offer. Uh, Chris Letang, Bobby Ryan, Evander Kane, uh, Nathan McKinnon. Alright, so Chris Letang around 25-30k. Uh, Bobby Ryan's your typical 10, so you're getting about 40 uh, with Evander Kane, McKinnon, I'm going to reject the other offer just because I think this deal is in the lead. Uh, Sharp, I know, is worth quite a bit just because he's a very popular player. If Even if he is 20k, uh, David Krejci is still a 13k player and you will get your 70k for sure. So I'm going to reject the Alex Petrangelo straight up. Uh, I, I like this offer a lot better, so I'm going to delay that offer. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, I just had to deal with something, but now we're back. But this offer is still in the lead, the Jamie Ben deal. Uh, then we got Marion Gabrick, Eric Stahl, Jordan Stahl, and Mark andre Fleury. So Gabrick's like a 10k player now. He's dropped in price, but he's actually a very good player. Uh, Eric Stahl, Jordan Stahl. Yeah, I'm going to reject that. The first offer is definitely better. Uh, Jeff Skinner, uh, Ryan O'Reilly, I can reject that. Uh, Kyle Poso, I can reject. I was really looking for the offers that are close, right? Jordan Stahl is like a 5k player. Bishop, I would say maybe around 30, 40. So you're getting about 51, 56. We can still reject that. Uh, the other offer was better. Let's see what we got here. Thomas Blacanitz, Gabrick, McQuaid, and 35k. A lot of hot lives, but Blacanitz like a 10k player right now. He's got crazy shot for uh, for his hot live card. Marion Gabrick, once again, 10k. So you're getting about 45, about 53 with a quick sell from McQuaid. And Blacanitz, uh, not horrible. Actually, not a bad trade, but I still like this deal. The Krejci and the Sharp. Uh, we got Callahan, Halak, Kunitz, and Boyle. No, no, thank you for that. Uh, what else do we got here? Joel Ward. No, I cannot take him. Sorry about that. We got Jelena, Varlamov. No, thanks. Uh, Varlamov doesn't go for too much from what I know. Tyler Sagan, Spetsen, 6. I know Sagan goes for around 45, around there. 40 to 45. With the pucks, you're getting about 50k. With Spetsa, I'm going to reject that. I do not want a Spetsa on the left wing, in my opinion. I'd rather take something else. Uh, especially that first offer was pretty good. But Nicholas Cronwall, James Neal, Pominville, and P Pavlich, uh, and 20k. So that's not too bad of an offer. I mean, Cronwall's usually around 30k. So you're get getting about 50. James Neal, Pominville, Pavlich. That's not horrible. I will delay it. Steen, Schultz, Benito, Placanith. I can reject that. Uh, definitely the first two are good. Uh, we, what else do we have here? Backstrom, Gabrick, Krejci, Ocposo. Uh No thanks for that as well. I know that... Doesn't go for too much. Doesn't go for over 70k. Uh, Chris Letang, Ocposo, Pacioretty, Giordano. I can reject that as well. Pacioretty has dropped down to 15k already, so that's not too much. 
Uh, Ryan McDonough, Shining Kirk, Green, and Gabrick. All right, so a lot of Columbus guys. Ryan McDonough is around 25 to 30, uh, around 25K. Shining Kirk is around, I would say, 10 to 15K. Uh, with Green, around 10K as well. So you're getting about 25. Uh, no, I'm, not, I'm gonna reject that. I wish they showed the last price sold uh, right below it. Unfortunately, it does not work, which is kind of glitchy, but whatever. Uh, 50,000 and Tim Thomas, no thank you for that. Uh, this deal is definitely better. Uh, what else do we got here? Nurse, Dal Cole, Sherback, and Morrissey. No thanks for that. Uh, what else do we got here? Lettinen, Koivu, Carlson, and Evander Kane. Uh, Evander Kane's around 10. Yeah, I can reject that straight up. Uh, I just know it does not go for 70. Just ballparking it. Uh, Eric Carlson, JVR, and 2K. All right, I like that. Burns, Marlowe, Thornton, and Evander Kane. I'm going to reject that as well. I got the whole San Jose line there, but I'm not going to take that, unfortunately. Just... Because I have most of them from free packs, so no point of taking it. Uh, and then we got Joe Thornton, Patrick, Gabrick, McKinnon, and look at that one puck. Look at that uh, generosity. I'm going to reject that still because uh, th there's only one puck. Uh, but David Krejci, Sharp, 37k. So Krejci's around, I would say a good 15k, so you're getting about 52. With Sharp, you're getting above 70k for that deal. This deal here, 50 I don't know how much James Neal goes for. I'm not sure if he's still a 20k player. Uh, but Pominville and Pavlich, you're really looking for right now Cromwell and Neal. I'm going to reject this deal. I like the first offer better. Uh, Eric Carlson, JVR, and 2k. Uh, Carlson's going for around 65. So you're getting around 70 on the dot. But we already know that this deal definitely above 70k. So I'm going to take this. Enjoy your Jamie Ben. I'll take those two players and your 37k. And uh, there we go. So we're going to move on to Claude Giroux. Give me one sec while I take a drink of water. Okay, we are back and we're going to check out Claude Giroux 20 trade offers. Oh, geez. This might be a while. Uh, you guys haven't really sent in any troll trades so far, so that's pretty much good. But uh, Backstrom Miller Stall, 2.9k. Uh, that is the leading offer, I guess. Uh, we got 35k, Chris Letang, Semyon Verlalov, Nick Benino, Bobrovsky, the 90 Bobrovsky. Uh, we can reject the first one for sure, but this one is worth quite a bit, actually. Chris Letang around 20-30, Bobrovsky 20-30, so you're getting about 80-90 uh, with the uh, Semyon Varlamov and Benino. Not too bad, I like it. Uh, Jamie Ben and Brian Boyle, I already have Jamie Ben on my team. I already have Brian Boyle in my collection. He actually boosted it, uh, but Ben we know is around 65-70k with Boyle. We can reject that. I like the first offer better. Uh, let's keep going here, but we got a couple more. We got a lot of offers to go through. Jeez. Say again, Cronwell, Smith, Skinner. Definitely under 100k. I'm going to reject that. Uh, what else do we have here? Eric Stahl, we can reject. Uh, what else? What else? 1,000. Uh, Joe Pavelski, Rick Nash, Victor Hedman, and Bobby Ryan. All right. So Joe Pavelski is around, I would say, 15 to 20k. With Rick the Dick, he's around 50k. So you're getting about 70. With Victor Hedman, about 100 110, so that's a very good offer. Solid deal uh, all together. Uh, I can, I'm going to reject the first one. I like this offer better. Uh, then we got Bergeron by himself. He's around like 85k right now. He's not too much. I know he's one overall higher, but he's not going for too much right now in the market for some reason. Uh, but let's keep going here. Wheeler and Oshi, I can reject that. Uh, let's keep going. I don't like the scrolling system on this, the RT. I wish he just went right to the right, like, right to the next offer. But uh, Jamie Ben, he goes for around 65-70. You're getting your pucks there, so you're getting about 85k with Nick Backstrom. Nick Backstrom's like 15 to 20k, so I mean, I like the first offer better, so sorry about that. I like this one. Uh, just I like the variety for sure, and they're all good, solid players. Uh, but what else do we have here? Kopitar and Seabrook. So Kopitar's around a 70k player. Seabrook, I'm not sure how much he goes for. I think he's still 30-40k, so that could be a good deal. I'll delay it. Jamie Benn, Ryan O'Reilly, Niemi, Gabrick. We can reject that. We already know Gabrick's not worth too much. Uh, not really a trading piece for me, at least. 90k I can reject. Uh, I apologize for him putting it for that much, but I'm really looking for players, not just puck straight up. Nick Backstrom, Pacioretty, Mason, and Gabrick. I can reject that. And we're nearing the end of the trades here. 75k and Vlasic. Yep. We can reject that as well. What else do we have here? Eric Stahl, Joe Thornton, Ryan Miller, and Vlasic. I can reject that. What else do we have? 1,000 and the Bobrovsky. No. Right trigger, right trigger. And we also got John Tavares. I think he's going for around 120. So I'm liking that. 
Uh, we got Kopitar, Oshi, Evander Kane, and Bobby Ryan. I can reject that as well. Uh, just all 10k players with uh, Kopitar. Not really my cup of tea. Uh, but for sure, Joe Pavelski, I like this deal. But when you compare it with this deal, uh, two players for one, I can reject this deal. I just do not like four for one deals. And this deal seems like an even 110k. But the thing is, I know John Tavares is going for around 115, 120. Uh, when the Mega Pack was out, he was around 100k. But now I think his uh, value has risen, just like Claude Giroux. So I'm going to take this deal. John Tavares, enjoy your Claude Giroux. Very solid deal, in my opinion. So let's go send that to the. Let's go to the active auctions, actually. So we got the last player here, Matt Duchesne, 20 trade offers. I'll be right back in like two seconds. All right, so we're on to the final player here, Matt Duchesne, uh, 240k start price, 20 trade offers. Let's see what you guys sent in. First one, Blood 7 Skating. Oh, geez. Is that a uh, that, um, bad sign here? Ryan Kessler, Backstrom, and Zach Parise, all in Colorado. That's not too bad. Uh, Zach Parise is around 65k, so you're getting about... Uh, 153 with Kessler, so that's about 190 with Backstrom. That's around 210, so that's a solid deal. I like it. Uh, Kessler, Petrangelo, Backstrom, and Nick Benino. Um, not too interested in that deal. I know definitely it's under 200k. That one's uh, just at 200k for sure. Pavel Datsuk is going for around 120 uh, with Nelson. He's quick sell value, so you're getting your good 6k pucks right there. Uh, Parise is, like I said, 65k, so you're getting about 70k with Datsuk. Uh, with Joe Thornton, Joe Thornton's going around 15, so you're getting about 205k with that deal. Not horrible. Uh, Ryan Getzlaff and 4k. Uh, Ryan Getzlaff's around 180, 190. He's not too expensive, uh, so I'm going to reject that. Uh, oh, what just happened there? I don't know why I just went all the way back to the beginning. Uh, we got, oh, is that a new deal, or did we reject it? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what happened. It's so glitchy, the system. Uh, Drew Doughty, Ryan Kessler, Jeff Carter, and Martin St. Louis. Drew Doughty is not too expensive. Uh, Ryan Kessler, Carter. Carter's a 30k player with Martin St. Louis. 50, 90, um, Martin St. Louis. I'm going to reject that trade offer straight up. I like the first two for sure. Uh, if I'm going to compare these offers, I'm going to reject this deal with the Pavel Datsuk. I do like Pavel Datsuk, but he is on the left wing, and this deal only adds up to around... 205 and the other deals going for at least 210 right so Claude Giroux Mark Stahl I can reject that that's like a 120k deal um we got John Tavares Jamie Ben Kyle Ocposo Jamie Ben's around 65k with John Tavares you're getting about 185 so I can reject that deal straight up uh, I like that first one better Mike Richards I can reject uh we got 5k Nick Benino Paul Stastny reject that for sure under under 20k uh, Joe Thornton straight up, no thanks. Uh, I'm thinking these are just troll trades. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, 28k, uh, Luongo Milestone Yager. I've not seen him before yet. Eric Stahl and Valtteri Filpula. Uh, I don't think Yager goes for that much. I mean, even though he is a milestone, I don't think he's going for like 100k. I'm going to reject that straight up. What else do we have here in the trade block? Bergeron, Kessler, Lettinen, and Fleury. Well, that's definitely under 150k. I can reject that. 2.5k, John Tavares, McDonough, Krejci, and Couture. So John Tavares, 120, McDonough, going for around 25, so you're getting about 145. With Krejci, Couture, under 200k. Good. Uh, next deal, Krejci, Lucic, reject that deal right straight up. Uh, Joel Thornton, Pavelski, Burns, and Steam. People like sending in that uh, San Jose line. I don't know what's with that. Uh, Phil Kessel, Marlowe, and Hedman with 45k. So Kessel's around 120. Uh, you're getting your pucks, so you're getting about 165. Uh, Hedman is around 30 from what I know right now. So that's about 195 with Patrick Marlowe. Pretty good deal. Not bad. Uh, Valtteri Filipula, Perron, Johnson, and Hansen. And then we're going into the last couple here. This one, Bergeron, Hedman, Bufflin, and Couture. I can reject that straight up as well. That's under 150k. So we got... We basically simmed it down to two trade offers left. It's around 15 minute trade day video, so not too bad. But Ryan Kessler, Backstrom, Parise. So Kessler's around 35 to 40k. I know that for sure because I sold him before. So you're getting about 128 with Zach Parise. So he's around 65k. So you're getting about 190 something with Backstrom. So you're getting about 195k at Backstrom or this deal. Phil Kessel, Patrick Marlowe, 
Victor Hedman and 45k and I think if I'm going to take any offer I think I'm going to go for this one only because I do like the player straight up and it's not too far off from what I'm looking for these both are very very similar offers in terms of trade value uh, I can relate Parise pretty close to Kessel except Kessel's almost double the value so you know what I'm going to go for this only because uh, not only is there a big amount of pucks in this which I'm not really looking for pucks uh, I'm actually looking for a player more more of a player because there's less of attack so I'm gonna go for this deal enjoy your Matt Duchesne and I will take those three players with the 45k so that will end the trade day results I'm gonna end it off with a premium gold jumbo uh, usually like what I like to do my uh, uh, in my trade day results but let's go to the store here open up 117,500 maybe we'll get something good to add into our roster or something like that and there, there should be one open now and thank you for everybody who sent in a trade offer. Thank you guys very, very much. Made it very successful for sure. And let's see what players we got. Santarelli, uh, Dan Boyle, Weiss or Weiss, whatever you want to call him. Steven Weiss. Uh, jerseys, jerseys, nothing here, nothing here. Yeah, so anyways, thank you guys very much for sending in trade offers. If you want to see more players up, let me know what players you would like to see. I just buy them from the market and I actually just throw them up like just depending on what I feel like. You guys will send in trades, so I thought Maddie, Shane, Ben, and Giroux would get a lot of offers, and it was true. So, anyways, if there's a player that you really want to see up on the trade block, post it in the comment box below. I might just buy it for next stream or next trade day. But thanks for watching. Hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys later. Bye. Uh, Phil Pila, Valtteri, Phil Pila, Thousand Coins, Ryder, Batman, Brooks, Orpik, Couturier. Anisima Fisher, Hodgson, Weird Card, Ennis, Hayes, and Elliot. That is such a bad pack. Alright, we have to go for one more.